Hello everyone, I hope you're all doing fine. This video is a quick unboxing, okay, for a new gadget I got for the channel, okay? So let's do that real quick. <laughs> As you can see, I just got this new Sony. It says here, I don't know if you can see it very well, Balanced Optical Steady Shot. That's the BOS that Sony has. And so I just got this Sony. It's just a new one. So let's see if it's going to hold up for the job I'm planning to use it for. Okay, so I'm trying to uh, spot from a new location where I'm going to see the, you know, the aircraft fly over me. And I really need something that can steady the shots. And what it says, it says it has like a gym ball, a gym ball inside of it. You know, the gym ball like the one you carry. Hopefully it does the job they said. So let's see if this big man will do the job. I first used this one. You know, you can see it. The Panasonic um, VX980, and it's a very good camera. But one disadvantage of this camera is that you cannot record 4K while you have an HDMI output. You know, you can see that's where you hide, you know, to bring out where you plug in your HDMI, and that goes into this device, right? But when you have this on, you cannot record 4K. And sometimes I need the footages for later on, you understand what I mean, to create my reels. So I need to do some, you know, crispy, clear reels for them. So this, I cannot record 4K while, you know, while I'm live streaming, you know, while I have the HDMI output to the device. But for this one, I can't do that because it's a more prepared camera, more professional camera. This is um, A6500. It's a very good camera in its prime, and actually they have had some newer models, A6600 and also the A6700, the one that just came out not quite long. So it's a very, very good camera, and all those models are compatible with all the Sony lens. So you can see I have the G lens 72350, you know, coupled with this, with this bad boy. I've used it for, uh, for musical videos, I've used it for wedding videos and ETCs and they all go nice and stand what I mean. It's a very, very nice camera. But what's the downside of this camera is this, especially when you're sporting. For photograph is lovely, but when you're sporting, you know, you're like, especially not like you're sporting. If you're going to spot and then edit the footages later, that's no problem. But I don't edit because I'm, I'm, you know, on live stream, you know, and when sometimes this hooks and it gives you that shakiness. So this is why I always advise they, for me, I use the camcorders because their zooming system is very, very smooth. And this camera, I'm going to be doing a lot of um, more handheld, especially when you, when I travel. I, I upgraded from this to this, and now I'm going for this because of the um, the BOS system that comes with this. Like it says, it has like a gym ball, you know, like I said earlier, inside of it. You can see it has like a gym ball, you know, like... It stabilizes like a gimbal inside of the system you know and it comes with a very very good very good battery i must recommend this comes with a good battery this actually didn't come with a very good battery it came with a very small battery i bought this battery myself you understand what i mean so i'm like using this opportunity and i also bought this gear now this this gear is very nice like for handheld you can it gives you a very a more firmer you know grip you know you know when you so it's a very nice thing you should also consider getting so i hope this um solves the uh, the comment section the question that always arises at the comment section about the gadget i use and all that thanks so much for your support i appreciate you guys love you all bye bye till next time